How are you, everybody? Nice. And good evening to all of you. Yesterday I briefed you on habits. And today I have to start to ask you questions. You have to reply me according to my question and also your presentations after question answers. Yes, I take a start uh, from Bilal Khan. Yes, sir. How, how you can define two habits? Habits, sir. Yes. Sir, the activities which are done by human beings, they're, uh, sir, if they do good things, they, these are the called good habits, good works. And if they do bad works, these are called their bad uh, habits. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, Jalil, how you can uh, uh, define two habits? Jalil. Abdul Jalil. Yes, sir. How you can define two habits? Sir, habit, sir, habit seems to be a nasty word at least for must of us. Uh, mm -hmm. Each uh, each has set up uh, routine or habits for doing things that we have to do each day. Okay. Right. What try? Yes, Ibra. Yes, sir. How you can define two habits? Sir, our daily routines uh, works in the part of habits. There are two types of habits, good habit no, and no, bad no, habit. No, 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 I didn't ask why about uh, types. Just define definition of habits. Our universe are called habits. Our daily activities activities are called habits, our daily actions are called habits, our routine works are called habits, our daily works are called habits, our daily activities are called habits, simple definition of habits. I ask you next question from Bilal, why habits uh, have great importance for us? What is the importance of habits for us? How you can uh, explain it? Sir, uh, habits have uh, very important in our life. If mm -hmm. uh, our habits are good, then we can deal with the people uh, easily. If we have bad habits, then no one uh, will talk with us or do any work with us. So it is very important to do to, to have a good habit. Okay. Habits. So, sir, this is the importance. Yeah. That good habits are very important for us to live in our society. Why not? I agree with you. Further, Abdul Jalil, how you can uh, how you can uh, tell me about importance of habits? Can you explain it? Yes, sir. Sir, uh, habits uh, that we usually do in our everyday, uh, good and bad. Uh, sir, habits are only one habits, which is a clean and dirty habit. And uh, good habits are the behavior and uh, smiling always, greeting, helping, uh, includes studying always, hardworking, reading books, and uh, working up early. Uh, sir, we know that everyone like people with these kinds of habits. Mm. Okay. And uh, bad habits. Uh, no, no. Simple, you have to tell us about importance of habits, not kinds of types of habits. My question is importance of habits. Why habits have great okay. importance for us? My question is uh, this. Okay. okay, you have to try it well now. So how you can explain to importance of habits uh, abroad? Sir, <clears throat> habits have great importance for us because everybody have habits. Nobody without habit yeah, exclude except mad persons have 
they have no habits yes okay. habit have great importance for all human beings certain so uh, i kill it now everybody tried well now what is uh, what is the uh, importance of habits uh, habits are most important for us all human being in the world have habits nobody can say that i am not happy it's mean person is mad or person is abnormal habits are part of our lives habits play major role in our lives habits have great importance in our lives habits are part of our lives so nobody can survive without habits in the world except mad person or abnormal person all people in the world have habits every person in the world has habits everybody has habits every one has habits so we can understand the process of habits in this way i ask you this question i take start from again i take start from bilal yes sir bilal you uh, tell me that how many two main types of kinds of habits what are two main types of habits sir habits have just two types good habits and bad habits yes sir certainly good habits are those sir that uh, if we if we are uh, honest and we help the people and we think about future to make uh, bright bright our future okay and uh, so we we mostly try to learn good things then these are called our good habits okay and bad habits are those sir if we didn't think about future and uh, tease the people and uh, sir don't try to make ourselves better so okay. these are not our good habits these are our bad habits right okay so a uh, same question i asked from abdul jalil what are two main types of habits and you have tell me detail uh, sir there are two types of habits uh, good habits and bad habits sir uh, good habits are the behavior and uh, good uh, good habits such has allies a greeting thing attitude needed in uh, becoming a good student include studying always uh and uh, the everyone like people with these kinds of habits and bad habits uh, one of many habits is being unpleasant some people like make unpleasant thing many people mostly road people do not pay you when talking and uh, they often talk loudly yes sir okay try it well abrar so there are two main types of habits good habit and bad habit so good habit if we study daily good habit if we pay charity if we think negative uh, positive good habit if we study daily good habit if we help to needly people <clears throat> okay good habit if uh, and the bad habit uh, we not say our prayers daily bad habit if we think negative bad habit if we uh not study daily bad habit yes why not so i explain it now we have everybody tried well there are two main types of habit good habits and bad habits so what are good habits that if we have to get up early in the morning if we recite the holy quran daily if we offer our prayer daily if we are punctual if we drink much water uh, if we respect our elders uh, if we make planning daily if we brush our teeth daily if we take bath daily if we uh, take a bath neatness if we wear neat and clean dress uh, if we have to speak politely if we go to sleep early uh, further thing if we study daily uh, if uh, we take part in sports if we speak english too much if we listen to english too much if we listen to scholars if we follow to our parents and teachers if we speak less if we listen too much uh, if uh, we follow to islamic teachings if we follow to uh, allah and holy prophet peace be upon him if we if we follow to holy quran and holy prophet peace be upon him if we uh, fulfill our commitment if we speak the truth uh, if we uh, you know uh, fulfill our promises 
and if uh, we do work according to our words and deeds our words and deeds are same it is a good thing a good habit further thing if we don't speak a lie if we avoid from back biting if we avoid from smoking if we don't take drugs if we avoid from bad company if we join to good company if we don't kill our time so these are these are all good habits and what are bad habits what are bad habits opposite of good habits bad habits what are bad habits if we don't get up in the morning if we don't say the quran daily if we are not punctual if we kill our time if we don't brush teeth daily if we don't talk bed uh, if we don't talk uh, don't take bath daily if we don't study daily if uh, we don't respect our elders if we don't respect our parents and teachers uh, if we join to bad company if we don't speak english if we don't listen to english news if we don't listen to bbc and cnn uh, further if uh, we don't go to sleep early if we look busy all time on internet social media and facebook if we take drugs if we look busy in smoking if we join to bad company if we look busy in bad biting if we don't fulfill our commitments if we speak a lie if we don't respect our elders if we don't respect our parents and teachers parents and teachers and uh, yet and if we are not responsible these are all bad habits if we don't drink much water these are all bad habits if we don't make plan our lives if we don't plan our lives these are all bad habits now next question i ask you why uh, what problem people have to face uh, to adopt good habits i need i ask you what problems you know why people don't adopt to good habits and why people adopt to bad habits what problems on the way i ask from bilal khan again sir uh, i think the major problem is uh, illiteracy and uh, environment around us sir if uh, the people do, do not have quality education then mm-hmm. even they can't comparison between what are good for them and what are bad for them good good so the the uh, the education is the best way to make the ha- habits of people good hmm. okay okay quite well now yeah abu jalil same question i ask you sir we are question a uh, problem is that uh, uh, what is main problem that people have to adopt bad habits and people don't adopt good habits sir uh, sir the habits and the quicker you can get into the uh, better and uh, success cool men uh, and the bad uh, reflex cannot be undone all alone uh, call it is crazy i watched the new channel a fair amount yes, sir hmm. okay yes abra sir uh, many problem take place like uh, people uh, if we don't uh, adopt good habits we f- feel uh, negative we uh, we in life our, our life we suicide mm. sir mm-hmm. our mind it changes and uh, many problem take place sir. okay so i throw light is also group discussion not only question answer also it is group discussion is running here uh what problems now i we have to face uh, you know why people have to face problems uh, and why people don't adopt to good habits and why people have to adopt bad habits first of all environment plays major role most people are illiterate as bilal said most people are illiterate on the other hand people discourage to good uh, good habits people encourage to bad habits is also problem so main problem is environment major problem is environment what is envir- environment people have to encourage to bad habits 
and people discourage to good habits it is environment people appreciate to bad habits and people dislike to good habits then in in this uh, situation bad environment takes place so children and kids have to adopt bad habits why due to environment in our houses i talk about majority of people i talk about majority of families have bad environment at home in their homes there is bad environment no check and balance our media plays major role internet facebook social media play major role to create bad environment on the other hand people have to kill their time on internet so, uh, social media and facebook people have to learn from each other if any person is unconscious how to use internet so other person will guide to other person but in negative way other person have to if any person is unconscious about anything automatically if somebody misguides to other person so he will learn same thing major problem children have to follow their elders people you know children have to uh, follow their parents and teachers friends most people have to adopt bad company so environment becomes so dirty so dirty it is dirty environment dirty environment multiple people are illiterate on the other hand people have to encourage to bad habits people have to discourage to good habits people don't follow the teachings of islam people ignore the teachings of islam in this connection in this connection in this connection media plays major role to develop dirty environment internet facebook social media play major role to spread dirty environment people have to use all facilities for negative purposes we can also use for positive purposes today net facebook and social media but we have to use most people have to use for negative purposes people have to use internet facebook and social media for negative purposes so automatically envi environment will make further dirty so three main things <coughs> play a major role to develop dirty environment next question i ask you you know that uh, what should be solution 
I need your suggestions. What we should do in this situation? Uh, I ask for, from again Bilal Khan. Sir, my suggestion is that that uh, firstly uh, the parents uh, the first training uh, to, to their uh, to, uh, the first training to make habits good for their childrens yes. and all the members of home. Parents are uh, should be responsible Certainly. that they should take care uh, that uh, they should take care. They will they sh- they must teach their uh, children good things. Of course. And uh, secondly, in the school, the teacher tell us about the what is the comparison between good and bad. Uh, what is good and what is bad for us? I then can't. we can then we can follow our teacher and our parents and make our habits better. That's good. Good suggestion. Gave by Bilal Khan. Yes. Next, Abdul Jalil, what to say about uh, suggestion regarding uh, how people have to uh, uh, adopt good habits? Abdul Jalil. Yes, sir. I need a suggestion regarding uh, good habits. How people can adopt good habits and how people can give up to bad habits? Of course. Uh, I need your suggestions. I need your uh, ideas. Like, I need your proposals. Yes, uh, like me, like my suggestion of Tom Sambian will fall on uh, deep ears. Here's suggestion by a computer generated. Play in power. Play for open ears. Yes, sir. Okay. Right, well. Yes, Abdullah. Sir, my suggestion. First of all, sir, we follow Islam, and then we can give up all bad habits, and we can adopt good habits, and then the parents uh, should play a major role to uh, uh, make uh, us. Uh, <clears throat> to make uh, children perfect and they can teach about uh, what is good habit and what is bad habit and also teacher prayer uh, play a good role in uh, teaching to teach us all students what is good and what is bad and also social media uh, uh, play a major role in this thing sir okay that's good now i tell you about suggestions uh, everybody tried well uh, first of all you know that uh, we should devote our attention to the teachings of islam first of all we should focus our attention to the teachings of islam we should understand to teach to islam what is islam we should study the holy quran with translation mostly muslims study the holy quran read read the holy quran in arabic only but most people are unconscious mostly muslims are unconscious what said allah in holy quran first of all by verse we should study the holy quran in urdu translation by words we don't, we have to understand the holy quran by words what what is the words in urdu from arabic according to holy quran words words by words we have to understand the holy quran by translation in urdu most probably we can give up to all bad habits and we can adopt to good habits on the other hand our parents should play major role to adopt good habits and give up to all bad habits because parents are our first teachers parents should provide 
religious education to their children first of all parents have to tell to their children about religions what are religions then other world subjects then about other knowledge first of all parents have to prefer to religion i mean to say parents parents should follow to and read holy quran and teach holy quran to their children with translation on the other hand we should listen to scholars we should listen to scholars so if we follow our scholars most probably we can give up to all bad habits and we can adopt to all good habits we should follow our teachers it is duty of parents and teachers to develop good habits in the society it is obligatory for parents and teachers to develop good habits in the society the parents should check the activities of their children that in which society children have to sit the check and balance is obligatory on the other hand we should make good friends we should avoid from bad company we should not kill our time we should avoid from bad biting we should be engaged in positive activities not negative activities we should study daily we need planning for future we have to think about today and we should think about tomorrow what we got today and what we have to do tomorrow what we will do tomorrow we need planning we should take care about neatness how it is possible if we offer our prayers five times a day so we can take care about neatness according to according to religion of islam the neatness is half religion our half faith is neatness as a muslim for the things we should be punctual we should be responsible we should respect our parents and teachers very important thing very important suggestion if we want get success in the world then 
we have to study all books in english we should listen english we should speak english we should listen to cnn and bbc cnn is american news channel and bbc is british news channel it is much better that if we have to kill our time is much better we have to improve, improve our english it is much better nowadays you can get any knowledge just in a few seconds by internet you are conscious about it. just you have to go on any website just in few seconds you can find any information about anything according to your requirement it is very easy to get knowledge nowadays in olden days or many centuries ago to, to find knowledge was very difficult to get knowledge was very difficult instead of people got knowledge we have all facilities we can get knowledge easily facilities we have all facilities instead of we don't get benefit from facilities it is not good thing we have all facilities to get knowledge instead of instead of we don't get too much knowledge okay now i ask you one by one regarding point of view on habits sir first of all ibla khan you said me just in one sentence i need your point of view on habits sir my point of view is that we should follow our role model and our role model is definitely the great prophet hazrat muhammad peace be upon him if we started following him then we will be definitely successful people in the world quite can right. achieve quite our goals right. quite right yes uh, abdul jalil i need a point of view just in yes, one sir. sentence two sentences sir point of view habits sir, uh, sir sometimes from the analytics point, point view for or from people coming from the outside point view we dump up we dump uh, on football people mm -hmm. yes sir mm. okay ibra so <clears throat> my point of view of habit is we study islam sir and we follow islam then we can give all bad habits and we can adopt good habits sir good Are you tried well now? So I tell you about my point of view. Same, my point of view is same like you as Ibrahim said and also said now. Bilal Khan. Just we have to act on teachings of Islam as a Muslim. So in short time, we can give up all bad habits and we can adopt all good habits. i accept it okay so now time of presentation everybody have to speak for 3 minutes on habits as a presentation let us start bilal khan sir our daily routine and our daily works are called habits habits have two types good habits and bad habits yes. good habits are those sir if we don't kill our time we we think about future we help the people and we try to learn most things then these are are called our good habits and bad habits are those sir if we kill our time we don't think about future and 
we we waste our time in the social media like facebook instagram etc and uh, we didn't uh, we don't speak english and uh, then then these are called our bad habits and uh, sir the problem is uh, to to adopt good habit is illiteracy if we if the mostly people are illiterate therefore they even can't uh, com- compare between good and bad things that what are good for them and what are bad for them so uh, the education is the best way to adopt the good habits and if we have good habits then these this is a uh, this is benefit this uh, the good habits uh, uh, can benefit us because the people will respect us uh, they will follow us um, due to our bid, uh, due to our good habits and they will uh, tell to their children to be like us due to our bad uh, due to our good habits and uh, sir uh, i want to say that we have, we should educate and develop the people so then they can uh, adopt the good habits okay that's it sir your theme is completed now okay anyways to spoke well yes sir uh, you tried well yes sir jelly let you start your presentation on habits for three minutes uh, yes sir sir habits uh, seem to be a nasty word at least uh, for most of us each of us has a set of uh, routine or habits for doing things that we have to do each day uh, enable used to things without having to think too much about them it is a behavior that we usually do in our everyday good and bad habits uh, habits have only one habits which is clean and dirty habits so good habits uh, are the behavior good uh, habits uh, such as a smiling less is greeting helping attitude uh, needed in becoming uh, a good student in cloud studying always hard working reading working up early we know uh, we know that uh, everyone like people with this kind of habit and uh, bad habits one of many habits uh, is being unpleasant some people like make something in uh, if you fall Uh, road people do not face you when talking and they often talk loudly and uh, point of views it is totally uniforcable from a text point in view switching point uh, view mid paragraphs is better from me some times from the analytics uh, from people coming coming outside point view we dump and put back your files yes sir Okay, quite well. Let's start now. Let's start now. So, <clears throat> so definition: our daily routine, words, activities, is called habits. There are two main types of habits: good habits and bad habits. <clears throat> good habits are if we pay charity, that's a good habit. If we take bath daily, good habit. If we say our prayers five times a day, good habit. If we study daily, good habit. If we teeth our brush good habit and if we study daily good habit if we uh, share our knowledge to other people good habit and the bad habits are uh, if we not pay charity bad habit if we not say our prayers bad habit if we speak too much bad habit and uh, if we uh disputes to any other people by little bit uh problem bad habits are problems many problems take place in the uh, um, bad habits are if people think sir uh, positive people uh, when people adopt uh, bad habits then they can suicide suicide our life they can not enjoy our life they can feel fear they cannot uh, desire all dreams sir and uh, suggestion my suggestion first of all sir we uh, adopt good habit uh, and we first of all sir we uh, study islam sir what is islam and uh, what is quran say we can read quran verses in translate in urdu and also sir english 